China just can't stop churning out fake humans. Almost two years after the Chinese government set out to mass-produce AI-powered humanoids by 2025 and lead the emerging market by 2027, early prototypes are graduating into next-generation machines ready for the real world. Today, it's the rising startup robot era, maker of the world's fastest bipedal humanoid, unleashing a suite of AI robots that are faster, smarter, and stronger than their predecessors. And in the tech hub of Shenzhen, DexForce is pushing forward a full-stack embodied intelligence platform to rival the likes of Tesla and Unitree. In Beijing, the successor to the world's fastest humanoid robot just emerged. Robot Era, which was spun from Tsinghua University in 2023, is pushing its suite of AI-powered humanoids to market with significant financial backing. The startup recently secured around 500 million yuan, or nearly $70 million, in a Series A round led by CDH Investments and Higher Capital. Their total publicized funding for 2024 and 2025 is over 900 million yuan, or $125 million. Robot Era gained significant attention in fall 2024 when its star One Biped achieved a top speed of nearly 13 kilometers or 8 miles per hour during a 34-minute run across the Gobi Desert. The former fastest bipedal humanoid, the H1 by Hangzhou-based Unitree, set the previous record earlier in 2024, topping out at just under 12 kilometers or 7.5 miles per hour. Robot Era's experiment also showed that robotic humanoids run faster when wearing sneakers than barefoot. Another one of its two-legged humanoids, the Xbot L, became the first humanoid robot to successfully walk the Great Wall of China. The way the robot walked weathered stone, climbed uneven stairs, and performed Tai Chi moves was seen as shocking just a year ago. But today, the demonstration would barely be noteworthy showing how fast things are progressing amid the international race toward fake humans. Humanoid robots today are performing elaborate dance routines, competing in long-distance races, fighting each other in the ring, and learning to enter unfamiliar places and get to work right away. They're also entering mass production and becoming increasingly normal in the real world, a trend analysts expect to continue until the world's like that Fresh Prince movie. Robot Era has reported shipping at least 200 robots so far. The firm's latest humanoid, the L7, builds on the Star One's bipedal agility, adding advanced upper limb dexterity. It's also faster than the Star One, maxing out at 4 meters per second or nearly 9 miles per hour. The robot, standing 175 centimeters or about 5 feet 7 inches, performed a range of industrial and household tasks in its intro video. The L7 boasts 55 degrees of freedom across its body, and joints that deliver a reported 400 newton meters of torque for fast and powerful limb movements. The robot can lift and carry up to 20 kilos using both arms. It maintains 360 degree spatial awareness with its multi-sensor fusion system that combines panoramic vision, depth sensing, and real-time positional feedback. The L7 features a swappable battery system, but its battery life has not been disclosed. Robot Era also offers an upper body only variant called the M7. Mounted on a vertical pillar stand, it's intended for applications that don't require mobility, data collection, and research. Robot Era's website suggests an easy upgrade path from the M7 to the full-bodied L7. The L7 runs on the startup's in-house Era 42 Vision Language Action Model, which equips the humanoid to understand and perform multi-step jobs without special programming. According to Robot Era, the AI model has been upgraded to make its humanoid smarter at handling complex perception to action tasks. Robot Era also recently introduced its Q5 wheeled service humanoid robot with a compact waist design that's narrower than an iPhone. Standing 165 centimeters tall, 
the Q5 boasts 44 degrees of freedom for tasks requiring human-like dexterity. Robot Ares humanoids integrate with its X-Hand, which has 12 degrees of freedom and tactile sensors for high-precision manipulation. The modular robotic hand uses a standard quick-release interface for use with other robots. Robot Era has reportedly already shipped more than 200 robots serving clients like Hire, Lenovo, and BZS Technology. Meanwhile, in Shenzhen, the booming Chinese tech hub, DexForce just unveiled its second-generation humanoid robot. The startup calls its W1 Pro humanoid robot a high-performance platform with its 34 powered joints for human-like movement. The wheeled humanoid's dual arms have 7 degrees of freedom each and are capable of lifting up to 10 kilos. Its AI system, called DexSense, handles real-time perception. Its control system is called DexCore, which handles motor control, perception, and task planning. According to DexForce, the W1 Pro operates for up to 8 hours per battery charge. Launched in 2021, DexForce says it's developing a full-stack solution for embodied intelligence, including intelligent sensors, 3D vision foundation models, and robotic software platforms. Its core offering, the Dexverse, handles simulation, physics-based control, and synthetic data integration. Dexforce is headquartered in Shenzhen and has offices in Shanghai, Beijing, and Zhengzhou. It's also registered as a U.S. entity in Seattle to support international operations. Dexforce is expected to showcase its flagship robotic humanoid at the upcoming World Robot Conference in Beijing. Another Shenzhen firm, Engine AI, plans to highlight its next-generation humanoid robot that builds on the freakishly lifelike capabilities of its SE1 and PM1 humanoids. It's codenamed T-800 as a nod to the iconic robot from the Terminator franchise. For more on that, check the related video.